In a media conference today, Police Commissioner Tom Kulunga revealed the names of five suspects that were escorting both Capis and Walimini to Port Mosby, among them a serving PNGDF soldier. First person is called uh, Philomena uh, Kalagus, 32 years old of uh, Oroi village. He's from Baren in Central Province. Uh, the other person is Margaret Dollar. She's 40 years of, uh, uh, from Kutubu, Southern Highlands. Uh, the third person is Kevin Combe, 35 years of uh, Bella in uh, Mendy, Southern Highlands. Uh, fourth person is Kelson Nelson, in the 40s of Yanguru, uh, Isibik province, and he's an ex-soldier. Uh, the fifth person is Stephen Yafai, 41 years of Karapia, Isibik, a serving soldier uh, at Mare Barracks. Police received an anonymous tip yesterday morning that Capis and Walimini were being escorted to Port Mosby in a land cruiser. The vehicle was intercepted by police and a cat and mouse game followed with both sides exchanging gunshots. Both Capis and Walimini were killed in the process. Commissioner Kolunga said it did not have to come to this if both criminals had surrendered earlier. Uh, known criminals are continuously being protected by relatives, family members and one dogs. Uh, those two people would not have lost their lives, uh, would still be living now, if people have not uh, protected them. In an interview with MTV's John Eggins, Prime Minister Peter O'Neill shared similar sentiments. He also passed on sympathies to the families of both men. It's unfortunate that, uh, you know, that uh, this has to come to this kind of an end. Uh, but, uh, you know, he was uh, imprisoned, uh, he has committed a crime, he should have saved his time and, and making sure uh, that he paid the penalties that uh, the society and the laws have enforced on him. But uh, it's unfortunate that he had to reach this kind of end, but, uh, you know, our sympathies to everybody, especially the families who have been affected by, by, by this, uh, this event. Police are interrogating the five suspects and more arrests are expected to be made. Cedric Pajole, National MTV News.